Okay. So I'm on Rattlesnake, um, Hammock Boulevard. Make a U-turn at Lely Palms Drive, Mandalay Circle. I went east, I'm sorry, west, for a little bit. From the place I left off in my last video. So now I'm going to take a left onto Ono. Oh, in 1,000 feet, make a U-turn at Santa Barbara Boulevard, St. Andrews Boulevard. Actually, I'm still going to take a left anyway, I guess. Make a U-turn at Santa Barbara Boulevard, St. Andrews Boulevard. I guess I'm not going to go down every street here. Let's see. Because I've already gone, I've already done St. Andrews, but I think there's another road that connects to this one that goes over south and east again that I want to take just to make sure there's no. Continue there. on Rattlesnake Hammock Road for one mile. So some of this is redundant with what I did in that In hour. 300 feet, make a U-turn. Make hour. a U-turn, then turn right onto Rattlesnake Hammock Road. Make a U-turn at Lely Palms Drive. That hour and six minute video that I did from Collier and St. Andrews all the way up to uh, Tamiya Metro. In 300 feet, make a U-turn at Cedar Crest Court. Linear make a U-turn at Cedar Crest Court. Sorry, guys. Make a U-turn at Lely Palms Drive. Make a U-turn at Cherry Hill Court. Which he stops telling us to take a U-turn, tells me to take a left, I'm going to take a left. In 400 feet, make a U-turn. Make a U-turn. In 500 feet, make a U-turn. Make a U-turn. I'm not doing this for entertainment, guys. This is data. If you don't live here, you can still watch these videos and you can figure out why. In 500 feet, make a U-turn at Muirfield Circle. Make a U-turn at Muirfield Circle. At, on Google Maps, you can follow this path and you can see them. That they're on the floors here. In 400 feet, make a U-turn at Deerwood Circle. Make a U-turn at Deerwood Circle. We may end up going all the way to US 41. I think there's another road that connects. I'm apparently not going to go down every single freaking road. In 600 feet, turn left onto Wildflower Way. But on the map, I'm still going to put that on there, but I'm going to... Try to get as many roads as I can. Since I don't have to hold. Turn left onto Wildflower Way, then make a U turn. Then make a U turn. Is it a dead end? I guess is the question. It might be a dead end. Well, in any case, let's check. Let's just check anyway. So there's no, theoretically, there still could be some down here. By the way, there are blue lights. I think I got those on camera before. Then. Make a U-turn, then turn right onto St. Andrews Boulevard. Okay, I'm not steady faster to go that way. <coughs> Continue on Wildflower Way for one and a half miles. Okay, good. So we're gonna take this route just to see if there's anything special over here. There shouldn't need to be. Like I said, the southeast end of Naples, they have lots of purple lights in the neighborhoods. So they have them in uh, Reflection Lakes um, and also in Charles Estates. So if you look those up, you'll find out they're at the southeast edge of Naples almost. It's before the Publix and Sandpiper something, but it's really close to the end. 
By the way, the Sandpiper one, though, that's a gated community anyway. So, if those purple lights somehow demarcate some kind of um, blockade somehow, by whatever means it would, you know, like mark it for that. Evacuating the southeast would be possible. Right? Towards Miami. Tell you one thing, I don't freaking think that they're for the vaccine, guys. I don't think they're to see if you got the job. A lot of them here are not even close to the. A lot of them are on some kind of road, but they're not near the main roads. But in the other places, they're on the main roads, mostly. Here, they wanted to hide them from these people. There are a lot of people with lots of money here, and they live in gated communities here. Some of them do. And they don't use them in most of the gated communities. Most of these communities, they're rare. Like, they actually are just in the gated communities they need to be in so far, almost. There may be with one or one exception that I can think of right now. But it still looks like they're there. Oh, it's for the gate. It looks nice, right? They have a purple light there. Well, guess what? They're not there. And they're not putting them there just to look nice. They're putting them there so that they can mark areas like they would in other cities. They're just doing it in a different way so you don't notice it. And you might ask, well, who is they? I don't know. Like, I've had people say, well, who's there? In a quarter mile, turn left onto Lely Resort Boulevard. Who's they? And they, like, it's, like, snide, like, oh, they made their point. No, you didn't make your point. The Homeowners Association somehow put those up because they had to. Uh, I don't know. Like, if they didn't, they were going to have a problem with something. They had to put them up for some reason. Turn left onto Lely Resort Boulevard. Okay, now this is actually where I think I should take a right, because I think I was on this road. I've already seen the area, by the way, in the other video that I did, so. In a quarter mile, make a U-turn. So I'm eventually going to have to end this one and then pick a different anchor here for my GPS if I'm going to do it that way, or just plan my road. So I can record again. I might have taken this road, I'm not sure. But I want to go down to uh, US 41 basically. And then uh, decide where I'm going to go from there when I get there. Make a U turn. Because there are some roads basically that connect. Actually, I might take a right. If there's a right, I will take the right. Road. In 600 feet, make a U-turn at Falcons Glen Boulevard. Make a U-turn at Falcons Glen Boulevard. Falcons Glen. In 500 feet, make a U-turn at Indian Wells Way. By the way, I don't see anything Make a U-turn at Indian Wells Way. Okay, this is Indian Wells right here. Or track, yeah, Indian. In 500 feet, make a U-turn at Mustang Island Circle. Make a U-turn at Mustang Island Circle. Mustang Island Champions Majors, to the right. In 500 feet, make a U-turn at Mustang Drive. Make a U-turn at Mustang Drive. Just some orange to the right. In 1,000 feet, make a U-turn at Michael Circle. Did she take it? She take it right. I don't know if she said take it right. If, if we could take it right, that's a through way. You can check out the road. Make a U-turn at Michael Circle. In a quarter mile, turn right onto Tamiami Trail East. Now we're at Tammy and Trail. I think I want to take that right that we could have taken because that's another. 
That might be another through way, so I'm gonna try to take a U-turn actually. Oh. We can't do a U-turn here. Yeah. All right, I'm going to end this right now, and I'm turn going to turn right onto Tamiami Trail East. Then